ndithi mandinibulisa kwakhona bathandi bezemidlalo kanye bathandi bebhola lasemzansi um, the past few weeks after um, a vacation year to December sibuye sibizi kakhulu PSL it came zidlala after the other so there hasn't been no space to breathe around these games um ndifumene ithuba ke ngoku sifumene ithuba sonke to breathe in uh, and then there is more in it now that uh, si kuvalwe i transfer window we've seen players moving from one team to the other we've seen new faces in the PSL coming from elsewhere yeah, it's an interesting um league that it is for those who love south african football um more than they do in loving um the specific brand that they support um it's very interesting in a sense that by the look of things one team that is really up to standard in in our football we all know sundowns that has won like 14 games in a row yo that's a record and the others are breaking band because they're breaking their own record uh, and uh, it looked like the sleeping giants and uh, all under paris they're starting to picking up it, it, it points and, and getting back to 11 yeah because they've won three games in a row since long long time ago so it's coming it's coming okay and if we remember very well uh, uh, what is gonna stop them from collecting 45 points of 45 in the second leg of the season of which they've done uh, nine out of nine now they've played three games they've won three so today uh, the focus is not gonna be there the focus is gonna be more on the signings on the transfers that has, has happened who moved from one team to where um because that's the more, most interesting part in our football and again the other interesting one is that if you're opening your eye in in our league as i said it's a more most interesting you can say about out of 16 teams as we stand as we stand as it stands as it stands mathematically geez 14 14 14 teams are fighting for relegation yes we, we're seeing richard spade they're doing so well they are up there but mathematically uh they can still go to the playoffs if anything goes uh wayward so not everyone is safe but only sundowns is safe you know uh it tells us something about how they do things um in in, in, in mamelodi uh, what other teams can learn from that um, with the nuclear resources that they have uh, what they can do because it's not new that teams don't have resources but they've been collecting points over the years so this thing of saying we don't have players we don't have fans now we must fight for relegation all of us to me it's it's a, it's a lame excuse but let's move on from that one let's move on from that one yeah um we've got so much interesting signings i will start about um sundowns They've done a very, very interesting uh, movement this window, whereby they didn't sign no player. In January, they signed no player. They just released players that some were on loan anyway. Um, our, 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 our source that we're going to be basing our argument from is gold.com. Everything that I'm going to be referring to from here is taken directly from gold.com as of yesterday, which is the 2nd of February um 2023 and, and, uh, and oh, gold .com that. based on what gold.com has said you know that's the trust, trusted source for now look uh, sometimes i sign angam kaiser chiefs have signed players Orlando pirates have signed players uh cape town city um signed players stellan porsche signed players um who didn't sign who else didn't sign we will see it from from our table here from our numbers here i will just mention those players now listing as as, the, as they are listed and then pick on those that we believe they are the biggest signings over this window uh we're gonna start by his school my daughter as a natural the glamour boys the glamour boys but for my name, Fanoamo, they have gotten their, their player there. We, we, can, we can call him maybe a uh, but he uh, signing. He looked to be a star. He looked to be very confident. So, we are going to go to. It's Chiefs signing Christian Sale. 
Mambiza ngo posomboli uh, from Jana Rangers in Zambia. The guy is from Jersey Congo. Uh, Ichi saine utatoyane utat, uh, utitlogwe abanya ba mazala ku super sport uh, some of us mazala ku ku Botswana national team chiefs those are the two players that have signed uh, sale it's a it's a transfer um, they, they, they they bought him bamtengile and then utitlogwe it's a pre contract uh, it's for free abamtenganga because una on a few months left in ku contract ya kena super sport and then say go under parents is gama kepula matot. I have sign a government to you in the book, can you about pick? They just sign, they keep on rebuilding, but it looks like uh, it's working in their favor. So far, they've got a cup. Uh, yes, they're out of the race for the league. Uh, however, however, uh, they seem to be boost, uh, boosting their team for other trophies that are on disposal. They seem to be boosting their team. To chase for that number two. I get come down as the parents, but they embrace playing in an African soil, in an African competition, uh, referring to CAF or CAF Champions League or CAF Confederations. So they are fighting for that one. What did they sign? Who did they bring? As I said before, they brought Craig Martin uh, from Cape Town City. They brought Isoabo Umaro from Cotton Sport in Cameroon. Um, they bought uh, Makesheni Makaula from Amazulu. Yeah, and then we can move on now to Sekukune United. Sekukune United has gotten themselves two market signings given Mashiginya from Marisbeck United and Kamohana Mohojo, a free agent that was in uh, Zuala in, in Netherlands. However, he was on free when he was signed. And then Stellenbosch, they got their son, they got themselves. Uh, Urenas, uh, Urenas, is one of the assisters, best assisters in PSL with about five assists so far. And yeah, so in the creative space in the PSL is one that is there among the, 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 the top, the top, the top six. And also they got uh, Odijong, Uenri, Siamazi getting at the first game of the season was bombarding and mesmerizing Kaiser Chiefs uh, from Royal AM <laughs> and then Super Sport United uh, they've got a new sponsor this one they're getting sponsors left right and center if how they go about doing it story for another day now they got Ikoka as a new sponsor they just got Johnson Johnson previous month as a new sponsor and they are Sponsored by Super Sport, they are getting sponsors. They are, they are not, they are not, they are not hungry. As their coach Gavin Hunters may may say when referring to to financial um, competition. Uh, they have signed Usarin Manon Yang. I'm saying every time we in Senegal, Unyang um they saying is the brother of the king, the tall man. Um, Unyang, the one that you know that was a top goal scorer in some of the years previous years in the PSL. He's a legend in the country because he played for teams like such as Super Sport, Morocco Swallows, uh, Sundowns, and many. So he's the younger brother of the guy. And they signed Zugile Keuti. Zugile Keuti just broke to PSL a few years ago, but he seems to be moving left, right, and center. He it, it doesn't stay in one team. Uh, he was, was at Cape Town City in a space of two years. He's been to Cape Town City. He's been to Amazul. He's been to Marisbeck. Now he has moved on. He has moved on now. To Super Sport United, and then there's Zakele Lepasa. Zakele Lepasa, Seamaz Songke, and I wasn't the Likama uh, against Kaiser Chiefs Gwinnett Bank Cup when they won while they were playing in the then called NFD. Um, Zakele is coming from Orlando Ola Pirates. He was, he was very promising, but maybe hampered by injuries. We really don't know uh, the base of the release as much as uh, a coach tried to explain it. Um, he's no longer young because back then we used to say he's young. So he's, he's super sport. We believe has gotten themselves a, a nice player there. Eh? And you got Solos FC that has signed Evans Rosike. Evans is a, we can call him a practical son of uh, Midendo because they were working together before. At my respect, they, they, they had a very good relationship before he was signed by Super Sport. And Rosike now is at Solos. Uh, they signed him for free. And then we've got Daniel Akpey. Daniel Akpey is a mask. The last time we see, we saw him play, he was a case of Chiefs. 
Uh, he had some good games at the Derby. Um, he saved them. He did make, make his name shame at Nashua right now. He can't take anything away from a Nigerian international. Uh, not Rosige, as we know, that is a Zimbabwean international. Uh, and then there's Bongane Sam now. Uh, Bongane Sam, a very sweet left back. Um, that uh, is coming from Orlando Pilots. Uh, Pilots, yeah. Him nigi the chances, uh, and I we don't know whether the injuries were in were hindering his progress um, along with the competition within the team because the team seems to be very ambitious this season. Uh, he's on loan there, and then Rale um, assigned Mtobozo as a dube free agent that has been in the books of all the Pirates for the past three years, but he only played uh, more games, um, full full season at Golden Arrows. He was also loaned at Rale M before. Um, and we've got Spurs so much character. Abam signed Guma Zulefc. Tia Scalax signed one player, Umpo Matekhan from Forest Rangers in Zambia. Zambia seems to be the biggest supplier from the African continent to our league so far. And then Arrows has got Sleto Gushe, Ostolo Gushe Shato. I am sorry, from Golden uh, Marumo Karant. Why man? It's Golden Arrows signing from Mar Marumo Karant. Uh, the team that is in the bottom of our league, but they seem to be releasing a lot of players. As as Nova Sebe Ponze Itao Lavain, they've said, we're done with this. And then we're going on to Marspec United. Marspec has got themselves, their kid. Uh, this, the one that they signed from is, is, a, is, a, is, a, is, a, is a man now. He's a kid in a sense that he's been there and out. They got him initially from Melody Sundowns. Joza Ali Meza. He went to them and he went back home. He's back again to the country from all the way from Venezuela uh, as a free agent. And then there's Bradley Cross. This one had a stint uh, training at Kaiser Chiefs. I wouldn't call it a trial, but uh, if it's a training, it's an audition, it's a trial. So he trialed the Chiefs uh, for a few months and now he's signed at Marisbeck United. And then we've got Kwame Pe uh, Pepra. Pepra, I guess, Mbonele last season, is, he was a promising youngster from Nigeria. He played for Orlando Pirates. Uh, Pepra, uh, gonna come back. He's one of the signing that at Impumelolo TV show, VR, VR Corner, that we believe is a top signing this January, given that he doesn't get injured. And we've got Rafik Tigwek. Um, Rafik Tigwek um, signed from Stellenbosch. And then Marumo Galant. FC, H, Master Klisha Babandu, they've been releasing players. They've signed one player. They've signed Judas Mesameti from Stellenbosch. Now, Judas was in Zilika, Magangubeti Timis and Gulu PSA. Victims of him has always been Kaiser Chiefs and maybe Mamelo de Sundowns. <laughs> and then Simen Amazul, Amazul of many Jodi February. Jodi, Abantaba Nins, Bamazala, Ajax, the defunct Ajax Cape Town. Um, but he was signed by Mamelodi Sundowns and he's been loaned to Richards B. He was previously in the Book of Sorrows uh, at a loan from Mamelodi Sundowns. Now he came to Amazulu and then we have got uh, Ujunia of Sede Dion. Sede Dion is, is having a very good start to the season. He was a gallant. Uh, Sede has got about four goals so far this season. So he's got a good start. So Amazulu, they, they got themselves. Maybe something that can, can, can uplift them in their moods because they seem not to be in the mood to compete for anything this is. And then there is the last one now. There is the last one now. Chipa United. Uh, everyone that is close to me knows that I've got um, a soft spot for this team. Uh, and I love it. Now they've done me a very, very uh, big justice by giving the one and the only uh, another chance in the PSL to entertain us. Not to care much about what does it bring in terms of productivity and stuff. Because I believe sport is about um, entertainment and productivity, not the other way around. He brought uh, Mr. Morgan Mamila, our CEO, our coach. Usipatele utsepo, skwama samataliani, matete. So who knows, who knows. So otherwise SA is gonna be entertained. So is the signing that uh, we can say um, if given a chance or if the team is doing well, I'm not saying if he makes the team to do well, 
Ubi TV and Zagago, we are likely to enjoy our uh, South African flag. Uzol Kibelo Matalian. It's a my years. Everything you can think of. I can't come as the Yomatot. Because tournaments are so cold. But you can't you pick this. Uh, this is the conclusion of uh, of the list of transfers that have have been done and the PSL this um, transfer window. It's very very much interesting, very very much interesting. And Zoktalek Kalini just listing few um, players that we think in the VR owner uh, they're gonna be lighting up the the PSL. We mentioned Sahil first game, uh, first assist. Um, showing a bit of confidence, lifting up the crowd when they were seeming to be a bit quiet, you know, very few players have got that got that zeal. So convincing I think he knows the term, but let's see how long he's gonna be doing that. Um Ipaga Paga. Paga Paga Sichino that's ye. This I know the players that I've mentioned. Godwa, Makeshani Makaula seem to be their uh market signing. Uh, he's matured, uh, he is old, he is graced PSL in his old age era because he didn't come here so early, but he showed a lot of maturity. Mazur. So, so Jonga Lendot in Makeshenis of Gains and Dun. Tina Rapoganimuna is a representative of the Arcon. Umakeshen in Dim Jonga Jongomdos of the Corner Pension and Pirates Play Sundowns. Gomes, I see him in the squad. I see him in the squad. Uh, is is too much hot. Uh, I'm not saying that uh, those the players that are the Pirates are not at his quality. They are at his quality, but they seem to be a player that is on form, that understand the task, what is at hand. He was in the past few seasons has been a captain at Amazu. Um, those are the signings that we can say, yeah, yeah, yeah. And Pepra at Marispec. Uh, Marispec for for most part of the season seem, seem to be. A very big contender of a year relegation without going to the playoffs. Uh, after resigning uh, Mr. Fatal Davids as a coach, things started to become in their way. And then now they have signed these players. And Pepra uh, is going to be that player that we see to be, that seemed to be a very, very um, good value for, 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 for their money. So uh, uh, at Impo Melo TV show, VR Corner. We said normally uh, we reference, we talk about numbers, emotions later. Now let's get on to the game uh, between Sundowns and All on the Pirates tomorrow. Uh, we don't like to predict as much, but uh, it looks like it's going to be a very, very interesting game. Pirates seem to be uh, getting back to their motto. German Chiluba Pirates has won three games in a row, but they are up against an, an uphill battle against a team that has won 14 in a row. That 14 includes Pirates in there. So it's rough, Kaiser are chased in there. Everyone in the PSL seem to be scared of Sundowns. Um, seems like this season, everyone is going to get at least a, a beating. So in the team of Parapa, as Gamma Kepul, as Kepul, as Gamma Spal, I look also on my feet. Home so so glad no matter what. Can you make the PSL? You can make the train. Can Mr. Rulani and a catch up again. I'm going to talk with these assistant coaches. I'm not going to list it according to what they say at Sundown. Of Ujola, Mr. Steve Kombela, of um, Mr. Mangoma Mid. They seem to be doing something. The PSL is going to be made for the next five years. So, my parapara man, the way you do picking a good matter, but as a VR uh, corner here, we're gonna be enjoying a beautiful football. To me, this is gonna be the most uh, exciting game of the season. Yes, there was one in the MTN8 when Pirates uh, beat Sundowns Trinidad. That was an entertaining game. Uh, that was an entertaining game. I think this one is gonna take everything that we wanted to happen because hey kubuya na bumbule yo 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 ne paga paga ngapo o hoto they seem to be getting back their mojo to kamacha is joining in the party oma show ni so pule they are back hey and funu teta next masaleng saleng is just although he isn't isn't been very consistent in the league but now he is getting the mojo he did us 
Very good. Good MTN eight. Now let's see in the league now. We wanna go now. Is getting into the mojo. So um, in Pumalola TV show, uh, we are gonna um support us and 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 let me say to you guys, thank you for for viewing this uh in the previous episodes. We are back in it. Uh, we're gonna be back here every week, giving an insight on what's happening in the PSL. Uh, bring in the friends. Let's talk football and comment if you want me to 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 focus more on our Angoni language and leave the, the 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 British language whatsoever. Um, tell me. It's up to you guys. I'm I'm, I'm really up to scratch. We are really um feeling your contribution and comments are gonna take us to the next level. We want this content to get into you. We want this content to give you what you want, not to give you what we want you to hear. Thank you very much. Let's see you again. But get a local mafik. All the best to every team that is playing this weekend. Thank you.